What you drinking? That's what I'm always drinking. Pee. <laughs> My wife made it fresh. Nice. Hope she doesn't have a UTI. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction needs some Corbin. I'm gross. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram Twitter, 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 Well, sometimes. Thanks on Patreon, follow us on Twitter, subscribe if you haven't hit the like button. I mean, if you follow me on Twitter, you're going to see a ton of just nothing. But you can follow the official or stupid reactions Twitter account. That's true. And my Twitter account. That's true. That uh, Instagram, you'll see very little. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll see a little bit more of me on Instagram. A little bit. Anyways, today we're doing a movie review. <laughs> Whoa, look what I did. I combined the looking here with the handle because I had this in my hand, and so I was giving it that motion. I love that motion. I do, too. I wonder, what, <laughs> wonder what I was doing today. Gross. Uh, today we're do, doing a movie we'll review. review. The um, <laughs> there you go. 17 film, the Malayalam film, Take Off. Uh, directed by, say his name for me. Uh, uh, that, sorry. yes. Mahesh. Narayan, who we've seen. Forgive the mispronunciation. Malak, see you soon, and I think something else. Um, but he also wrote this one as well. But I think this is one of his. I think it was one of his. Because early was, on, because he it? was an editor first, I oh. believe. Right? Why do I want to say this is a de debut? See you soon. Shh, do, 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 do. Editor, 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 editor. Uh, take off, director. Okay. <laughs> editor, 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 editor. Yeah, so if it's not his debut, you guys can let us know. Obviously, we I know him as the editor, and then obviously we've seen his other two films, which we actually really enjoy, uh, The Malak and uh, See You Soon. Enjoyed both of those, but obviously starring... Let me go back here, because Fafa is in it, but he's not the star. No, he is not a, not uh, a star. Parvathi. Thiruvothu. And... Um, is that? Yeah. Yeah, it's Shahid. It's uh, Kunchako Boban. And then, obviously, Fafa right. is uh, also in it as well. Supporting. Uh, came out in 2017. So if you haven't watched it, go watch it. We, uh, I think India has it on Hotstar. Hotstar is not available here. So we had to go to other means to watch it. Uh, <laughs> we had to go through a bunch of ads. Yeah, which makes no <laughs> sense. Because it's not supposed to have ads. It's so and annoying. And we logged in, and there's still ads. Very, very annoying. Yeah. Um, but anyway. Yeah, so it'll be 100% sore if you've ever watched Go watch it. Come back. Uh, and you can tell me what you thought. I This was a mixed bag for me, this film. Me too. Yeah. Um, I thought there was some good stuff, and especially in the second half, I, I, I much more enjoyed the film in the second half. Um, and a lot of it might have to do with maybe some financial um, constraints. Could be. Uh, or, or maybe just being a new director. Uh, stuff like that, but a, a lot of it was like technical for me, and yeah. then also like the the first half there was some you know pacing, and then there was just the other stuff that we'll, that we'll get into. But yeah, it was a mixed bag for me. Totally. I agree, it was a mixed bag, and I say that with with kind of a feeling sorry to say that because I feel like um, like with most with most movies, unless it's just straight out, you know, all they were doing was trying to make money, then I don't have any qualms whatsoever yeah, yeah, complaining yeah. about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. but. I felt like this was a, a very genuine attempt yeah, me too. at making a film, yeah. not a movie. Yeah, I do. And, and the fact that it misses in some spots that we'll get into yeah. hurts, Yeah, but it also doesn't make me not suggest it yeah. as long as you go into it knowing yeah. the things we'll talk about. Mm -hmm. I, I would prefer, there's a lot of other movies I would prefer, prefer people don't see and see this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Absolutely. Yeah. I think there there's a lot to like about this. Film. Yeah, it's like, it's like it, they should be encouraged for, yeah. for having done, I think, their best that they could with what they had. Yeah, yeah. I, I totally agree because there's a lot um, that, I, that I did really enjoy, especially in the second. I felt, thought the movie could have even started at the interval, almost. It, um, it, 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 it could, could have. have. Although I, I actually... But you did care about the characters yeah. more because of the first half. I, ca I, I actually enjoyed I the first that. half in terms of the care yeah. and, and appreciated just going along with the story of this couple, particularly the fact that they're dealing with some things that too many people deal with all the time, yeah. which was a different form of orthodoxy, which you'll hear me say that word a lot in this review. <laughs> um, orthodoxy, yeah. yeah. Uh, but let's just get into um, uh, my, the performances. My favorite, uh, Pravathi, mm. she is 
She's my favorite part of this entire film. Me too. Um, she did a phenomenal job. She, she does a great job yeah. carrying the film. Yes, she does. Yep. Uh, and uh, I think actually the other girls as well did a really good job. I think uh, as a whole, the ladies were better than the men. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And obviously, Fafa did well, but it's not like he didn't. This wasn't a role for him to shine in, though. So it's like, <laughs> yeah, it was. It was um, for, for, we, uh, just kind of like okay. Fafa did, 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 did well. Did what you're supposed to do. <laughs> yeah, it's but obviously this is not this is not his vehicle. This not is Parvathi's vehicle. No, yeah, um, it, it would be. It's like even if you put um, Irfan in this, yeah, it would have been like he did well. He did great. Yeah, and that's really all he had the yeah. chance to show everybody to do with yeah. that role. She though, uh, and I, I know people have been telling us to get to her for a long time because she's one of the the better actresses in. Uh, some say she's it's, the best actress in Malayalam cinema. It, it shows she's um, good. And we've seen her one other time, and I don't know if you remember where it was. But I wouldn't it, off the top of my head. Was, You're probably going to shock me. It was in a supporting role. In uh, 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 Bangalore Days. Really? Yeah. Huh. Was, I would have never placed that. It's been a long time since yeah, we've yeah, seen it, Bangalore it, Days. It was a long time, but uh, we, we saw her in Bangalore Days. And I'm sure we liked her. Um and, no, he's also saw in uh, uh, Virus as well. I was gonna, that's the one I was just gonna say. I was thinking, you know what? I bet it was Virus because so many people have come up in that film. But when you said Bangalore Days, it cut Which, me out before uh, I said OSR it. Which, OSR trivia, first film after the pandemic <laughs> started. Because I was like, hey, let's watch yeah, one we'll about watch, watch a movie about oh, a pandemic. We're all gonna be in this for the next few weeks. Yep. Let's just watch. <laughs> We were so naive. Yes, we were. Anyways, but uh, yeah, I, I loved her performance. I, I love the nuances she brought to it. I love the emotion that she brought to it. Yep. Uh, and the complexity of this character and her relationships to everyone. I, I agree completely. She was believable um, all of the time. She is what kept me invested. connected and invested yep. when it, it never went off the rails. That's a term we like to use all the time. I felt like it got a little off track at points mm -hmm. in, in the story. And um, but we'll get into that in a second. Performance wise, yeah, the best thing about the movie for me is her performance. She's yeah. what holds the thing together. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I totally agree. I'd love to see more of her. So please, yeah, let I us would know, too. Uh, more and I like we said. I thought Fafa did a, a good job. Yeah, but he, he's just a, a small supporting role. It, no, it's it, one of those things where you could have put any able actor yeah. in the role and they would have done a fine job. Yeah. What you get with him is the fact that everybody knows it's Fafa. Yeah, and you're going to enjoy. The fact that he's in the film, but this was even before. Like everybody was like Fafa crazy. Everybody's right. Fafa crazy now, everybody's right? Fa right, exactly. But and then I thought, um, uh, even though he was even smaller, I feel than Fafa. Um, Conchaco Bobin. Yeah, I, I, I enjoyed him. I thought he did well. I did too. He, I he thought wasn't, he, did well. he wasn't Pravathi level, but he. Uh, I thought he did a, an admirable job. Agreed. in it as well. Agreed. Um, the um, the the another thing I really enjoyed about this film uh, was the the second part pacing. I thought was much much better. Than the first half pacing. Well, and you have a completely different kind of story going yeah, on. Yeah, it's almost two different films. Yeah, you do. They literally the action doesn't start until after the interval. Correct. And so, and then obviously the stakes are extremely high. Yeah. Um, and obviously it's a true story. And from what I well partially partially true. Yeah. from what I'm told they stick for the most part to for the most part what happened outside of I think there were like forty something people. Yeah, as opposed to as opposed to nineteen, the, the nineteen, which yes. yeah, it's understandable. But that that that, that the majority of this, and we're we're talking about this, assuming everybody's seen it, because this is five years ago. Yeah. So, um, and I'm uh, assuming everybody knows about the event too. Yeah, and the event, but that there was a deal that was made with the with the royal family in some way. Nobody yeah. knows what that is. Yeah. Um, that the girls were treated okay. They played off the fact that they weren't all Muslim, but made them believe that they they were, which is truly remarkable. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, I don't. I, I. I. I don't know how much of it took place. Like the the scene where she went to go get the phone from the f girl in the shower. Yeah, it may have happened. I found it hard to believe that a woman would get away with talking to a, 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 yeah. a soldier of either ISIL, ISIS, or Dash. Yeah, to, that way. Maybe it's just because she was Muslim. May have been. I don't know. May have been. Uh, but they, I actually they did enjoy that scene a lot. That, and one thing they didn't clarify, really and maybe they didn't in real life, but I, I would have thought as well, and again, this could be my ignorance, that they would have wanted to clarify not that not just that you're Muslim, but are you are you are you Sunni? Mm. But in particular, because of the different branches that those organizations are are rep I don't want to say they're representative of, yeah. but that they claim to have yeah. the carte blanche understanding of and everybody else is invalid yeah um but yeah but anyway I, I that, did, that was just a minutia of of paying attention i to did things. enjoy the pacing and especially in the second half i thought uh, that it, it definitely it's better to have a i think a stronger second half than a if you're gonna have one or the other str stronger second half 
Uh, of course, yeah. Because obviously you don't want it to just die off and, and, and all that. No, and, so- and you needed to establish the, 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 I mean, if you have any kind of empathy, you're going to care about these ladies anyway. Yeah. But, but the fact that we get a human interest story in the midst of this, which I understand you need to have it. And I don't know if they just weren't able to access real autobiographical stories because people didn't want to share them. Mm-hmm. Um, because, my, for, you know, for if I'm producing, directing, or in the creative control of a film, I would rather have the real stories than create a, a, a fictional one. Yeah, absolutely. But my guess is maybe they really, maybe none of these ladies wanted to talk about it mm-hmm. and they wanted to tell the story. So they came up with a concept that was very believable. Yeah. I really believe that. And we had to care about this family. Yeah, and I enjoyed... Um... And it looks like he did the edit. I mean, that makes sense. Obviously, yeah, it makes He's total sense. Um, there was a couple points where, like, you got shocked at some of the stuff that happened. Yeah, like when the the, the hospital like blew up. Yeah, it was like genuinely. I was like, oh, jeez. Yeah, <laughs> what just happened? Yeah. Um, and so, the, 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 I liked all those elements. I thought the, it, it kind of carried itself. Oh, very... on the per- performance thing. Before we get more into the story, just one other thing about the performances. Uh. Some of the smaller roles, like not even supporting, were. Um, Hard, yeah. I, I was going to get into the stuff I, that I had more problems okay. with after after I after was done. After summation, okay, yeah, yeah. Because I, I have I have the same. <laughs> okay. There was there was some white actors, but it wasn't just the white actors. No. Uh, this time, yeah. But there, there was some, and they were just as bad as always. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I, I enjoyed those aspects. Um, I liked the score as the well. Score, I liked it. I, th- it was a little too over dramatic for me a lot at of times. End. For me, it got a little soap opera y at the end. Well. Yeah. A lot of things got that way at the end. Yeah, of the yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was there was definitely an over dramaticness yes. of a lot of things going on. Even in the beginning, I, I didn't love the the some of the times over dramaticness of like them just talking and it's the soap opera uh, kind of music going on behind it. it I get it. It's kind of just how India's done it for a long time, and it's a different style that's just not mine. Yeah. So I I'll chalk that up to just creative differences mm-hmm. something because it, it happens a lot in indian films it that does it like that was over the top and like no that's just how we like it i'm like okay cool whatever it's just not my thing right <laughs> yeah i don't like it it got a little too over the top for me especially in the in the in the score aspect of it. It, it it only did that for me a little bit toward the end when everything started a little to become over dramatic a little too rah rah sis boom ba. Yeah, you know, the kind of complaints we had about eighty three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that 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 happened a little bit at, toward the end there, and that's when the score for me got a little bit. It's like, okay, and that's another thing. I feel like India is like people love that feeling, I guess, of in the, in the film of being able to have this national pride and. Well, uh, we it's, do too here in America. Yeah, but it's it sometimes just a little heavy handed. Yeah, right? when you take it to the place of, I'm not saying it was this, but when it feels like it's entering the realm of not. Um, celebration, but manipulation mm. or capitulation, then I lose interest because the motivation behind it to me isn't. Um, uh, it's it's just to yeah. make you get the feels versus yeah. being genuine in the moment. Yeah, that was some of the stuff that was uh, a little over the top for me. Just a little, yeah, just a uh, little. For the most part, I thought the writing was good. There was some aspects that got a little cheesy at times as well. And so that's why and I say simplistic. Yeah, sometimes that's why I say this is a very mixed bag cuz sometimes I'm like, "Oh, that's really good. The writing was really good there." Right. And then sometimes it's like, "Eh." And then sometimes I like the score a lot, and then sometimes I'm like, "That was a little too over dramatic." And then same thing. Uh it's, that's why I say it's a, it's a very mixed bag film for me. And then also on the performances, you have some great performances like Pravathi, right. who does a phenomenal job, and then Fafa obviously does well, and then the other but, the but then smaller... you have smaller roles like some of the terrorists are like, "Eh." And then obviously you just have terrible people like the white people coming in and <laughs> yeah, she, like she came in and I was like, oh god, man. I know the minute they come on screen, man. <laughs> oh my god, deliver a line. How hard is it? It's amazing. <laughs> Apparently, it's really difficult. No, it. You know, there's a reason they don't have acting reality shows, kids. <laughs> it's a very, very difficult art form. Um, Not everybody can just get up and do it. Yeah, so like overall, I thought I'd give this film probably about a seventy-five out of a hundred. Yeah, I gave it around. Pretty, I around gave it. it like two and three quarter stars. Okay, um, which 
on my scale, that's actually not bad because that means that there's elements of it that I, you know, not everything's going to be a five. That's hitting yeah. it out of the park. Um, but it does where it misses for me is is the things we've already talked yeah. about. I don't want to harp on on anything because there there wasn't anything that's like blatantly awful. There's yeah. been many movies we've seen yeah. where I've groaned out loud and yeah, went, yeah. "Oh my goodness!" and looked at the clock and went, oh, "How much more do I have to sit through?" Yeah, that, I was never there. No, I stayed in, engaged. I thought they did for what they probably had as a very low budget. I'd imagine the budget was real low on this. I, I thought that their their um, graphic damage to people from bombings and stuff was uh -huh. actually quite good makeup-wise. Yeah. That I could agree. have sucked, and they did a really, I thought, an admirable job. The makeup crew should be commended yeah. for what they probably had as a very low amount and a pretty unforgiving work by, obviously, the direction of Mahesh, but the cinematographer, Sanu John uh, Var Varghese, forgive the mis mispronunciation, but there were some pretty unforgiving shots to give you that sense of what the nurses have to look at in the horror. For me, the largest thing for me is her performance. But yeah. above all, the story has a level of, I mean, how do you not call this an important story? Because yeah. it is based on a real event. Yep. And there's there's so much not said about this event. Because you don't have this event if you don't have what we did to Iraq. Yeah preceding it a few years prior. What, America did something to Iraq? Because you, all of this happens- that was a joke. Because we created that atmosphere for it to happen. And that's the underlying sickness I felt watching this thing, yeah. was how yours truly included at the time had been manipulated by my government and our allies to believe the lie mm -hmm. that now had Saddam Hussein been funding terrorists? Absolutely, he had mm -hmm. been. Yeah. Did he did awful, evil things? He sure did. But trying to make a connection between him Amen. definitively and this threat of weapons of mass destruction that never materialized. Yeah. And I think it's pretty ironic that former President Bush had the faux pas the other day. Yeah. I don't know if you heard that. No, and I did. But yeah, or if I, you I, heard that. I had the, but that's I had the for same. me was underlying all of this. I'm watching every moment thinking. It's no different than Syria, man. We yeah. created this situation, and nobody really in America seems to how give many a innocent ass. How many innocent people were hurt because yep. of what because we did? Because of us. Yeah, um, I had I had the same feeling. Um, but it, it I, I did my, like my, I think my favorite thing is the same thing as well. The, the the overall story, and I think that the second half definitely carried the film for me. But then also Pravati's performance and getting to know this aspect of. The ISIS and and yes. the war in Iraq. Yes. Um, from the Indian perspective. Yeah, it's, it's all. It's also so interesting to see wars that we've grown up learning, just obviously from the American side, usually. Understandably. Or maybe the Iraq side. Those are usually the two sides. They're the two main people. But yeah, there's... two main people. But there's obviously always people that are impacted that you Correct. don't anticipate impacting. Correct. Um, and usually you only get that in very well researched films or. or you always get that in a good documentary. Yeah. But it is important. That's that's why, for me, the big takeaway from this, if anyone said, should I watch it? I'd say you absolutely should. It's an important story. Yeah. And you're going to see a great performance by the leading actress. Just go in with some understanding about this being low budget, maybe some things that happen with the writing that might not be very believable, and maybe yeah. some saccharine sweet like nationalism at the end. But if you just set that in your mind and sit back and, and relax, you're probably going to enjoy the movie. Yeah, I, um, I agree. I, I totally agree. Um, and it, even though I say it's a mixed bag, it's I, I still think it's a film that's worth watching. Me too. It's, it's a good film. It's more positive. Yeah, I, I sure. totally, totally agree. Yeah. Uh, but anyways, let us know what you thought about this film and what should be our next Pravathi specifically. I, I thought of one other thing because I said I'd say orthodoxy a lot and I oh, didn't. Oh, yeah, you didn't. But that was one of the things that from the very beginning and all the way through, it just hammered home because it's been on my mind a lot in the past several years, but it's getting even more intense as in um, the country, we're getting close to midterm elections and mm. we just had our mass shooting that we did, which immediately draws lines in the sand between the two parties. Yeah. But this movie in the, both the beginning on a personal level and in the second half on a larger governmental and country level, underscores the fact that, in, in my humble opinion, I think there's no greater evil in this world than religious orthodoxy. Mm. And that religious orthodoxy is the preeminent enemy of liberty. 
Mm -hmm. And that has nothing to do with any country that you come from. Anytime liberty and freedoms are infringed, mm -hmm. it is almost always a result of either two things. Yeah. Racism mm -hmm. or religious orthodoxy. Yeah. And it is it, it is it is so painful to rehash things that not only took place in the past that should have never happened, but to know that it's the more things change, the more it stays the same. It's still going on. Yeah. The, 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 these bad actors, <laughs> not the white ones, um, <laughs> the, but the white ones, the, the 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 ones that want to propagate their theocracies, and it happens in every place, need to uh, just go away. Yeah, I totally agree. <laughs> go away. I totally, totally agree. Um, and so, let us know what you thought about this film, which will be the next Malayalam film and the next Pravathi specifically. Yeah, love to watch. Uh, her. Would love to watch more of her work, especially her thespianatic work. Uh, please send it our way so we can watch it like it's hot. Let nice. us know down below.